Alright guys, what is going on? Welcome back to another video. Another reaction video. Today we are doing a reaction... Oh, the fuck's happened to my, my head? My head's expanded. No, I think it's just because I've got hair on my head. Anyways guys, I'm going to chuck on my Rams cap that is signed by the great Jack Youngblood. Um, it's still got its tag on here from 1990 something I believe uh, from one of my absolutely amazing subscribers and um, I knew I was going to wear this hat today because we're going to be reacting to some Rams players. There's probably going to be heaps of Rams players in this list just like last year. In fact what were the teams that had the most players? It was Rams, it was Seahawks, Steelers, All right, number 91 for the Rams, Andrew Whitworth, offensive tackle. Left or right, I'm not sure. Let's get into it. Three minutes long, starting with Mike Daniels. The quicker you're here, the faster you go. That's why where I come from, the only thing we know is... He's just a crafty vet, man. Those gray hairs, they're a symbol, that's a badge of honor when you have gray hairs. There he is. And Andrew Whitworth... He's showing them these gray hairs aren't just from stress, that's from experience, baby. You get gray hairs from stress? That's why I've got a few. I've actually got a few gray hairs, guys. It's fucked up. It's really fucked up. I'm only 28. What's going on? As long as I don't go bald by 30, I'm happy. I'm upset. I trimmed my beard down the other day. It's kind of disappointing. <laughs> Very sad. I'm disappointed in myself, honestly. <laughs> 37 years. Just before your interviews on the top 100. Why? Don't. Andrew Whitworth is the oldest offensive lineman in the NFL. <laughs> I call him the OG in the game. You feel me? <laughs> but don't let. All right. Let me see this. Oldest current NFL players. He's got to be up there. <laughs> Fuck you now, look at this. 45! Kicker. <laughs> Holy fucking shit. Alright, Eli Manning, 10th, 38. 38. Julius Peppers, defensive end, 39. Josh McCown, 39 years old. <laughs> Quarterback. Holy fucking shit. Um, he's been playing since 2002. Drew Brees, 40, for the Saints. Who's still killing it? John Denny, 40 years. He's a long snapper. He's been, he's been playing since 2005. Sebastian Janikowski, 40. Tom Brady, 41. Matt Bryan, Bryant, 43. Phil Dawson, 44. Playing since 99. Adam. Vinatieri, 46 years old, place kicker for the Colts. When the hell was that picture taken? It looks like it was taken back in the 90s, mate. Probably was. You've been playing since 1996. Right. Whitworth must be younger than 37 or 38. He is 37. 6 foot 7 and a cool 330 pounds. Yep. Look at this block. Get out of here. Oh, 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 oh. Beautiful. I want to see that little toss, actually. I want to see that little pass. The toss. Oh, beautiful toss there, mate. Beautiful toss. 59 had no idea what was going on. But don't let the beard fool you. Oh, see that man? See the quarterback? He's rolling out to the right, but he gave the quick toss off to Gurley. This guy here was just about to go all the way out here, but got fooled, and now he has to try and follow Gurley this way. And he's too late. Gene is still a great OT. Where'd that 59 come from? This OG is still a great oh, okay. <laughs> but don't let the beard fool. I think this guy. This OG is still no? a great. 
but don't let this guy this one beard fool you this OG is still uh, okay. OT. Yeah, no, no hope, He's mate. See, really, that fullback coming across, I'd call him a fullback, but he's a safety. He should have got him. But don't let the beard fool you. This OG is still a great OT. This guy at the back. Let the beard fool you. This guy this here. OG is still a great OT. With his tackle this is your man, man. You should have smashed him right out. Oh, flowers! Flowers ain't gonna stop a six foot seven, three hundred and fifty pound monster coming at him, is he? No one's gonna stop that. You can try, flowers. It's a great feeling. Oh yeah. Great feeling just to be able to run to the left side and just see him just open up the hole for me. Of course, that'd be a great feeling. That would be fucking amazing. I'm just gonna stare at him uncontrollably to make it awkward. I like this guy, man. Important for any offensive lineman. I like this guy. But if you want to spend 13 seasons at left tackle, you better be able to. What happened there? But if you want to <laughs> run blocking, dominant. Is important for any offensive lineman. But if you want to spend. Oh yeah! And stay down. And stay down. Seasons at left tackle. You better be. How many seasons? But if you want to spend 13 seasons at left tackle, you better be able to protect the quarterback. You know, he's a bigger guy, you know, lanky, and even though you got some speed on him, he can get you with his long arms. Lanky? I think other than Linval Joseph, he has the longest arms in the NFL. He knows Linval! He guys off that quarterback. You know, he's playing some of his best ball uh, the last two years. Whitworth outstanding on the edge. Still mean not many guys are just able He's to run huge. Andrew Whitworth. What a job by the offensive line. I'm extremely personally happy for him to be able to make it to the Super Bowl. <laughs> really going into Super Bowl week, I never had the Big feeling wit. like, all right, this is it. Like, you know, win this game and walk out a winner and, and walk away from your career or lose this game and at least you played in it. But, you know, your career's over. You had a great year and great career. Uh, never had that feeling. I always had the feeling of win or lose, I still want to keep doing this. All right, boys, let's play now. Just and loves football. I still love this game. I still love the passion. I still love getting prepared for these weeks. I didn't really feel an end coming. And after the game, it really didn't change. I felt like, you know what, I want to keep rolling. I want to keep playing. And uh, I still love what I do. We need to keep him as long as we can. Hmm. Yeah, well, they lost in the Super Bowl, didn't they? 6-3, I believe. Super Bowl 53. Nope, 13-3. The Patriots bet the Rams. Indeed. All right, guys. Number 91, we're done. We're done with uh, the top, t the, the, the bottom 10. From number 100 to 91. Now, who's the next player on the list? Julian Edelman. Oh, I don't think we're going to be able to stop now. Julian Edelman, Devin McCourty, Cameron Haywood, Cam Newton, Darius Slay, Frank Clark, Jarvis Landry, Harrison Smith, Bradley Chubb, and Trent Williams. Well, all right then. I'll see you guys in the next one to check out Julian Edelman. We're going to switch the hat over because, believe it or not, I do have a Patriots hat. And uh, regardless of what you think about the Patriots, um, I've actually got an Edelman jersey as well. Maybe I should go home and get it. I think I might need to go home, get every single piece of NFL equipment I've got, and then if any team comes up that I've got a piece of equipment or a... Or a, a a jersey or a hat or something of that team, I'll put it on and, and use it for the reaction. I think that's going to be a good idea. So with that being said, before I jump into Julian Edelman, I'm going to go home and get my jersey, put it on, put my hat on, and I'll be back here for number 90 on the top 100 list of 2019. Thanks for being here, guys. Really appreciate it. Peace out.